Mary Patterson is just like any other 20-something living in a big city. She's got a great job, an active social life, and a loving family. But there's one thing that makes her life very different from others. Thank you for joining us, Mary Patterson. So how long have you been microwaveless? About two years. One day I was heating up some queso and my microwave just stopped. So one minute you're making your favorite Mexican dish and the next minute you're faced with a life-altering decision. What do you do? I panicked. Freaked the fuck out. Started frantically pushing all the buttons. I tried different outlets in the kitchen. I, I tried outlets in the living room. I even googled how to fix a microwave that just stops when you're heating up queso, but it was too late. <sighs> Shit. Did you even consider buying a new one? I mean, I, I considered it, but who has $30 just lying around? Sometimes we're left to deal with our lot in life. It takes a lot of courage. It's more about acceptance. Mm. I'm no different than you or anyone else. I hate it when people look at me like I'm some kind of freak. Hey, MP, the bean dip's getting a little cold. Um, could you put it in the microwave for a minute? I can heat it on the stove. Okay. I still know how to enjoy life. I like to spend time with friends, go to the movies, watch Courtney and Kim take New York. You know, what most people don't realize is you can make microwave meals in an oven. Mm. Tell me more about that. Well, at first the limitation seemed insurmountable. All I could think was, how am I going to make oatmeal? Oh, you know, I was just thinking the same thing. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Oatmeal is tricky. But after some trial and error, I've learned how to cope. I have to wait two minutes for an electric kettle to boil water. I pour it over the dry oats and wait. It's time consuming and the volume of cooked oatmeal is never as large as it was in the days when I had a microwave, but I get a little stronger each morning. Now part of my job is asking the tough questions. What about popcorn? Popcorn was really tough. It's almost impossible to make popcorn without a microwave. Do you need to take a break? No, it's fine. Okay. It's Friday night. Footloose is on TBS. What do you do? I know it sounds crazy, but I chop up some celery, smother it in peanut butter, and get comfortable on the couch. No one likes to watch a 25-year-old Kevin Bacon dance it out without popcorn. No one. But I make the best of what I have. And what do you have? Counter space. Counter space. Mm. Thank you. Thank you, Mary Patterson, for sharing your struggle with us today. Please join us next week as we dive into real life. I've never been to an app store.